And that is it from House of Lashes. <laughs> okay. Today I have a super duper exciting video for you. I have a haul from House of Lashes and the brand Bravon that I've never heard of before but I was looking online to see some like new and well not new but new to me indie brands that I've never heard of and I just wanted to try out some new products. So I guess I'll start out with House of Lashes first. So this is the little box that it came in and says all the pretty things. Now, the main reason why I placed this haul was because I saw a video that one of the girls did and she put bottom lashes on her lower lash line and it just opened her eyes up so much and I, I obviously have bottom lashes but they're not very prominent so if I put mascara it looks like there's nothing there <laughs> and I've always wanted I've always just loved the look of super big uh, fake lashes on the top but also having a really full beautiful lower lash line and it really just opens your eye up and makes you look more awake so that was the main point of this purchase so these are the bottom lashes right here. Uh, these are in the style, they're all in the style Darling. So I got three of those and they're really interesting. I, <laughs> I actually was just kind of playing around and I put one of my super short upper lashes on my lower lash line and it just looked weird. <laughs> it looked like I had slept wrong and I kept my fake lashes on and they just ended up on the bottom it did not look right so I was like you know what I'm just gonna go ahead and buy lashes that are specifically made to be put on the lower lash line so I'm super um duper excited for these and this is what that looks like so I got three of those and then I got some individual ones I got the lip petite triple which are the super full thick ones and then the Le Petite Single and the Le Petite Double. So these single lashes are really, really nice for a very, very natural look. Well, I guess the triple ones will give a full, you know, very glam look. But since they don't have a band and they're just singles that you place on, they look more natural than actual fake lashes. So I'm really excited to experiment with those. And then I got three of the just normal fake lashes. All of these are the mini ones, which are created more for those who wear glasses because the thing that I cannot stand with fake lashes, and I loved just like full, like super huge lashes, but I can't wear those because every time I have my glasses on, they hit my frames and it smudges them and I it like I can't blink right and I just it just doesn't work <laughs> so these mini ones are shorter and they're designed to not hit your eyeglass frame so um, yeah I'm very very excited to try these out these are the Noir Fairy mini this is the iconic mini and then this is the wing it mini so um obviously i'm pretty sure all of you guys know the house of lashes iconic lashes they're iconic <laughs> so these are just the smaller ones and they're super pretty and like crisscrossed these noir fairy ones are like they have some shorter lashes but they also have some longer strands so they look very like fluttery and then the wing it ones these almost look like they're double stacked and i think they are so there are those guys and that is it from house of lashes <laughs> okay now let's go ahead oh my god i was supposed to use this in the video because i think it really goes with this look and i didn't put it on so isn't that pretty i just love how it looks on camera i feel like it ties the whole look together uh this is the huda beauty lip strobe in bewitched i, I don't know why i just put that on but there you go <laughs> so so Bravon Beauty is something that I've never heard of until like 
two weeks ago and let me just preface this by saying they have one of the best customer service services <laughs> out there so as soon as I purchased it I got an email from Nicole I think her name was Nicole I'm not 100% sure but I got an email saying hey we got your purchase we're actually gonna throw in a three-piece full-size thank you gift and I was just like oh my god that is so sweet and it wasn't just like an automated we got your like a confirmation email it was like an actual written out email and I just thought that was super nice and then they even wrote me a little message handwritten message that says thank you Allison enjoy your new products and the enclosed bonus samples plus free gift please help us out with a product review or two um, and it's just basically just telling me how I can write a review but I just thought that was sweet so let's get started with the full-size items that I purchased everything came packaged beautifully now I am going to say um, this isn't sponsored they don't know that I'm even a youtuber basically I to them I just came off as a normal customer that's just going on their website and buying products everything came beautifully packaged it has this Ravon beauty tissue paper and these are the two full-size items that I purchased so this is the luminous skin perfecting foundation in the shade warm beige and <laughs> I feel like some of you guys are like this with bronzer or like blush maybe where you're trying to find like the perfect bronzer or the perfect foundation and I'm like that with that with foundation I just feel like I have to try all kinds of different formulas even if I have a foundation that I love I'm like but maybe there's something better <laughs> so I wanted to try this out um, like I said this is the luminous skin perfecting foundation comes with a pump and the color match looks perfect it's a very yellow toned foundation which is what I need and it just seems like a nice kind of warm medium beige kind of color so got that guy <clears throat> and then this is the lip prefix primer liner in the shade iced fairy so this seemed like a Kind of like a frosty berry color if i can take it out <laughs> so there's what that looks like and i all of my lip liners are matte um just because i feel like that's how a lot of lip liners are formulated to be matte but they actually had a lot of shimmery frosty lip liners so i was very intrigued to try this out Ooh, that's a really pretty color obviously you guys can't see that but i will be putting close-ups of everything I think that's really pretty it's kind of I would hmm, I don't know if I would necessarily call this berry <laughs> maybe I would say it's more of like a terracotta pink with some silver and gold shimmer throughout it so very very excited to try that and then the thing that intrigued me the most about this brand is they actually sell samples so this guy here is called the try out custom sample six piece set plush plush <laughs> plus brush so there's that little brush in there and it comes in a cute little nylon case so basically you can choose different products to create a little sample set and I think this is perfect um, they actually have this for skincare, for foundation. This is kind of just like a mix of everything that you can choose from. So I think it's especially good for foundation if like you don't know what uh, shade to choose, but you want to try their foundation out. You can actually choose six different shades and you can sample them. The samples that I got, this here is the Brilliant Touch Mineral Wand in the shade Silk Glow. So this is very similar to like a YSL Touche Eclat. It's a, smells good. <laughs> it's a, it's kind of like a brightening concealer. It's very, very light coverage. It's not meant to be used like on pimples or anything. It's specifically made to be used underneath the eye area that really brightens your face up. So got that guy. And then this is the, oh, so <laughs> 
you can like <clears throat> type in the order notes what shades and what items you want in the sample kit and I my dumbass only chose five items instead of six so then when she emailed me I was like oh my gosh I didn't choose six items just surprise me <laughs> so she threw in the smooth start perfecting foundation primer looks like that and this is a silicone based primer Let's see here Ooh, oh that feels like super silky doesn't feel drying but I'm not the biggest fan of silicone based primers just because I do feel like it accentuates my dry patches but it feels very very smoothing so if you like the Smashbox photo finish primer this is a really really nice not dupe obviously but it's very similar it feels very similar and then this is the Susumu Suede Blush in California Poppy. Now this is originally a pressed product, but obviously it's going to come loose. Oh my god. That is like a neon orange. I definitely did not expect it to be this bright. It's a very, very bright orange. On their website, it seems more of like a light orange coral color with a very pretty golden glow this is very bright <laughs> but i'm really excited to use this for the spring and summer months and then i got the hd vinyl liquid lipstick and hot buttered rum there was actually a comment that i saw on the bravon website that said this is such a beautiful lip combo with the lip liner shade that i got so i wanted to test this out um, it's a liquid lipstick that doesn't matte down. It stays very glossy, so it's very pigmented, but it stays glossy. So this seems like a perfect terracotta color. Again, obsessed with my terracotta shades. <laughs> the next thing that I have here is the Hydrating Dual Action Concealer in Light 2. And obviously I got this to use with that foundation. So the reason why I wanted to get this is because I didn't really know, like, you know, how the coverage was going to be. I didn't know if the color was going to be a good match. It's so weird. I'm really good at choosing foundation colors, but I suck at choosing concealer shades. So I wanted to get this concealer and also the uh, Brilliant Touch one just to see which one I prefer. And then I got the Lip Spa Aqua Gloss in Iced or Sweet Iced Tea. And this also actually looks like it's going to go very, very nicely with that lip liner. It's actually the same color. <laughs> it's like a pinky terracotta color with a golden shimmer. So very, very excited to try these glosses out. And then they were, oh, and then this is the brush that comes with it. It's a, it's just a very simple, small eyeshadow brush. The quality feels really nice, super soft. Um, the brush is very densely packed, so it's going to be really good for packing on color on your eyelid. But it comes in this cute little mesh bag as well. They actually sent over this huge sample kit for me to try out. Um, they just included this as a free gift, and I thought that was the sweetest. Like, they're very, very generously sized. And this is basically two of these sample kits like the sample kit that i bought this is basically two of them so they sent this for free and i just thought that was so generous of them so i'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on these because there is what 12 samples to go through i'm just going to kind of run through them so i see here that this guy exploded a little bit so let me just wipe him down but this is another one of the Brilliant Touch Concealers in Pearl Glow. So have a couple of different shades to try. Um, I got the foundation shade in Fairly Medium, which is a little bit lighter than the shade that I bought in the full size. But um, I assume this will work really well for me in the winter months. What else is here? God, that concealer got everywhere. <laughs> okay, and then they sent me a few of the Magnetic Eyes eyeshadows. So I have the shade Oyster Pearl and Sand Dollar, which looks like it's going to be a beautiful 
this is like a coppery shade and this is like a shimmery nude and then ooh, I wanted to try this out this is the diamond eyes brightening powder so it's a pinky based powder it I'm not sure if it has any shimmer to it but a lot of people use this underneath their eye area to really just brighten their face and get rid of any dark blue um, under eye circles so I'm very very excited to try that all of these samples are very very generously generously sized they're not just like you know one-time use and throw away samples they'll you can use them probably like four or five different times I oh my gosh they sent me a sample of their magnetic eye primer this was actually sold out I was gonna buy a full size of this but oh my god I'm so excited for that so there's that I got their Susumu blush in hibiscus and Camellia Rose. Camellia Rose is a beautiful mauve shade and hibiscus. So hibiscus actually looks closer to the shade online, to the California Poppy shade. As I said, California Poppy is like a neon orange. This is more of a subdued orange, so that's kind of what I expected the other one to be. So. I'm glad that they sent me this shade. And then I got another sample of the Hydrating Dual Action Concealer in Medium. So I'm <laughs> pretty happy that they sent me a sample of this because one that I originally requested was Light 2 and then this one is Medium 1. Three more samples here. So this is the uh, Motto Matte Moisture Lipstick in Stay Strong Scarlet. Ooh, that's a beautiful red. Very, very pretty. Um, to me, it looks more of a warm toned red, but I won't really know until I swatch it. And then this is the lipstick in First Kiss, which is a beautiful brown shade. It's not a nude, it's definitely a brown, but it's a light brown. So I think that'll be beautiful in the fall. And then this here is another one of the vinyl liquid lipsticks in Chic Nude. And this is again like a light brown shade. It's not nude, it's just a light brown. Because <laughs> I, I feel like there's a difference between light brown and nude. And then finally, let's go ahead and get into this cute little gift. I have no idea what's in it. Beautiful ribbon all around it throw that <laughs> okay so let's see what's in here oh my gosh oh my gosh you guys this is amazing okay so they sent me a pencil sharpener for free which is always good because I always need these I keep losing mine and misplacing mine so I'm very very glad that they sent me one of those the first thing that I got is the Oh, this is actually a highlighter in the shade Golden Glow. So, I wanted to try out their highlighters, but I, I was just like, okay, I already have so many highlighters, I don't need another one, and then they sent it to me. <laughs> so, very, very excited for that. Oh, this is pretty. This is just like a perfect champagne gold. Let's see how it swatches. Ooh. Oh my god gosh that is stunning you see how that catches the light there absolutely beautiful except I don't I hate the packaging of all these because it's a screw-on I would rather just have like a flip top but it's all good and then they sent me the gel tech long wear eyeliner in the shade oh it's not black it's crystallized wood which seems to be like a olive green kind of color so excited oh oh <laughs> that is beautiful it's like a olive green with a very, very strong golden shimmer oh that's so pretty hopefully you guys can see that shimmer there this is the lip spa aqua gloss in mimosa so mimosa is actually one of their newer shades um, I believe it just came out Guys, I cannot open anything with my long nails. <laughs> okay, this is what that looks like. It's a coral pink color. It's like a very, very warm toned, yellow toned pink. And, oh, oh my God, that smells so good. It, 
what does this smell like? When I first smelled it, I was like, it kind of smells like amaretto, like the liquor. I don't know, it smells really good. <laughs> and it feels really nice as well. It comes with a standard doe foot applicator. And there is what that looks like. Super pretty shade. It's not like a, you know, insanely pigmented lip gloss. It is a nice wash of color though. So I feel like this will look beautiful on top of any lipstick or you can even wear it by itself. It's just a very, very beautiful shade. Okay, <clears throat> that completes my haul. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Overall, I think both of these brands are amazing. I assume that not a lot of you guys know of the brand Bravon. Um, I think it's a beautiful brand. The idea and the image and just what they believe in, I truly believe, is such a beautiful thing. And I feel like their company as a whole really cares about their customers. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please let me know in the comments below if you have any videos you want to see, um, how you guys are doing in this whole quarantine thing. <laughs> so, like always, stay safe and healthy, and I'll go ahead and see you guys later. Bye-bye.